Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome back. So today is Easter. So I mean the day this will be uploaded is the day after Easter. But seeing as it's Easter and seeing as I have just built or like somewhat finished building this new shop over here, the 414 shop, this giant concrete building. There's still a lot of work that I need to do on it, but it's coming along. So I decided to put on a Easter egg hunt. So basically, every one of these books has a number assigned to it, and in my shop, I'm gonna put up signs at the end of this video showing what each number, like what the prize is. Some of them are just gonna be like really good items, like good armor, or good books, or maybe even just like diamonds, or maybe even netherite, we'll see. Um, and then others will be like coupons maybe for my store, get some more business going in there. But yeah, so basically all these eggs are gonna be hidden like somewhere near a path. So the first spot we're going to go to over here is the spawn, and we're just going to, so basically what I'm going to do, oh I need chests, don't I? But yeah, basically what we're going to do is we are going to have a concrete block sitting on top of a chest, so then once you break the concrete block, you'll be able to open up the chest and grab whatever's inside. So I believe we should have enough chests made up here. We just got to go grab 10 of these because there's going to be 10 eggs in total. So there we go. And then let's throw these, I guess we don't really need that because we're not going to be, like, we're not going to be, like, hiding them underground at all, I guess. Well, actually, it'd be kind of, they're going to be under a concrete block, so I guess we might actually need a shovel. But let's go get over to the spawn here. And we're, we also need to get out my water. I guess we'll replace the fireworks because I just need the fireworks to get over here and then we'll just walk along the path from there. But I think just, like, right back in here will be good. Turn that into concrete. Oh, actually, I probably should have uh, put the chest down first, huh? Because now I gotta pick that back up. Alright, so there we go. Egg number one. Let's actually put that in the center of the chest. There we go. And then... Oh, we should have... Okay. Now there's gonna be... Uh, I guess we'll just go like that. Never mind. Okay, that's perfect. Alright. So, what color do we want to do next? I think we'll do yellow. So we have 10 eggs in total to hide. So we can kind of spread them out a bit. Like it's not a whole ton, but it's also quite a few. I think that will hide the next one, like just right up here next to these yellow flowers. Yeah, let's actually put the chest down first. Let's be smarter about it this time. Not too far down. My shovel goes too fast. All right, egg number two. And then let's move these down here. Just get ready to put those. Put that down. Oh, this is going to break the... Okay, we were fast enough. I was going to say it's going to break all the flowers. <laughs> so that's not going to be hidden. It's not like that's very hidden anyways. But, I mean, it's not a whole lot of hiding spots. I, if I should have had a white... If I had a white egg... But I wanted them to be colorful because Easter eggs are supposed to be, like, colorful. But if I had a white egg, right, hiding right here would be, like, the best spot. I really wish that... Actually, I suppose... No, there's not really a way to prevent the path from getting covered in snow here, is there? Because I don't want to put torches on it, because that's what this glowstone is for. But the glowstone doesn't melt it, I guess. Now my inventory is going to be all full of snow. Yep, my inventory is full of snow. Yeah, it's fine. It doesn't matter. Alright, next color. I think we'll do red next. So, let's hide it. Let's hide it, like, right before the bridge here. Maybe, like, let's move this red flower down, maybe? Or no, let's, uh... Let's put it on this side, by these this red flower right here. It'll go right here. Alright, this is egg number three. There we go. Okay, and then next we'll do pink. Actually, we'll do... Uh, I don't have purple. I was going to say we could do purple and like have it blend in with the obsidian for the portal. But we'll do uh, magenta, I guess. And we'll put it... Uh, it's not really... Hmm. Right, I guess that we'll just hide it. We'll just uh, take out some of this obsidian here. Oh, that kind of leads underground there, doesn't it? Uh, just go like this. And then like that. And then like this. And then like that it's not super hidden but it's hidden enough all right so that is egg number five oh, i was about to say five that's egg number four 
So we have like half, so we're halfway done hiding pretty much. So where do we want to hide the next one? I guess we'll do pink because that's the last color we haven't done yet. We're going to do all the colors twice, obviously, because we have five colors, but there's 10 eggs. So I want them to be like next to the path, but like not, obviously I'm not going to put them like in someone's house. Oh, we're gonna, we should have um the last egg will be like around my shop, I guess, because I mean, my shop is where all the prizes will be coming from. So what is this? I don't remember this house ever. Hmm, I don't know whose house that is. Um, the problem is, like, there's so many houses everywhere, like, I don't want to put them in someone's house. Ooh, I think that will, uh, let's put it right here. And then let's actually put the chest down first again. So, egg number five. Alright, there we go. Now, let's go back to, so our final one's going to be blue because it's going to be by my shop and my shop is like light blue kind of um all right let's put this one we'll put it right before this bridge here we'll put it actually let's do one um underneath the bridge on this side actually like right here actually we'll yeah we'll go down one all right this is egg six let's get the egg on top all right we have a few more left to hide. I think we'll do, let's do a red one next. We'll do it like around, like right before these houses up here, I think. Put it right next to, we'll put it behind this tree because hopefully this guy's house, whoever's house this is won't be on. <laughs> Otherwise he'll just find it right away. Actually, I probably got to put the, uh, <laughs> the egg in there, don't I? All right, there we go. Nice. All right, I think that's all we'll put over here. And then we have, what, three more left to hide. So we've got egg eight, nine, and ten. Next one, we'll do magenta. Okay, and then let's put this one, like... What is this wood thing here? Is this, like... I don't know what that is. Hmm... Let's hide it like back. Let's hide it right here. Right next to this house. So this is egg number eight. We have two more left. So we gotta find the spot for one more. And then the last one is just gonna go like around my shop, like around the corner. Or maybe we'll put it like inside my shop even. That could be a good spot. Because no one will think to look in the shop, like upstairs we'll put it. Because most people don't really go upstairs in the shop. Because there's nothing up there right now. Um, I guess we could put it over here somewhere. We haven't put any over here. We'll put it right here. Don't want to have that block broken behind it though. Alright, egg number nine will be not blue. We need blue for the next one. It will be pink. And I forgot to put the egg in. Or no, I did. Did I? Yeah, I did. Yeah. Let's put it in the center, though. Hopefully, I remembered to put all of them in the center. I don't know if I did, though. All right. And then the last egg will go put by my shop somewhere. I'm not sure where exactly yet, but somewhere by my shop will be good. By the 414 shop. Um. Okay. Do we want... Do we want to put it, like, back here? Or... I think, actually, hmm, maybe we'll just put it, like, in this, under, we'll put it down here, actually, will be good. This is a good spot. Let's actually put it down one more, though. All right, egg number 10. All right, there we go. We've got all 10 of the eggs hidden around the islands. So later today, when everyone starts joining, I'll uh, let them know that the Easter egg hunt is going on and they can go find them. But before we do that, we need to put up the signs in my shop that show what the prize for every um, egg is. So let's go grab some signs real quick and then we can go throw some signs up in the shop. So I'm going to, you know, I suppose let's, uh, all right, I guess what we'll do is, do I have 10 shulker boxes? No, but I could make 10. So let's actually do that. 
And then we're just gonna like get all the uh, prizes into these shulker boxes and I'll just like line them up in order. So chests, I know we need, oh actually why did I make more chests? We already had grabbed a bunch of shulker boxes. Oh, uh, you can't stack them though. <laughs> I mean, okay. Let's see, how many do we have here? This should be enough with all the ones that I already have. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, okay, so six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. I would like color code them to like the color of the egg, but. I don't want to, like, waste the dye and then dye them forever like that. Alright. So, what do we want to give away for prizes? Um, Alright, what I'm going to do is let me grab some more ink and a feather so that I can make, like, some coupons for some of them. So we have four books. So four of them are going to be coupons. And the other four will be, like, items. So I think that what we'll do is, let me just go make these real quick. And then, oh, you can't stack books either. All right, let's go. Oh yeah, this will be like the best one. So, okay. Um, let's say like coupon for 414 shop. And then 25% off your entire order and then we'll have it expire <laughs> in like three days we'll put that at the bottom as well as like a little code number at the bottom so that i know it's not like a fraud expires on april or good we'll say good through Good through April 20th and then the little uh, barcode at the bottom we'll just um, type a whole bunch of numbers in like sections of four okay there we go assign Easter coupon and then 414 Shop. I think that I don't want that all to be caps though. Alright. Easter coupon. Okay, the next one, let's try to keep it the same format. It's a coupon for 4 and 4 shop, and then whatever the coupon is, and then the date. All of them are going to be the same date, and then different codes, obviously, for all of them. Those are just so that people can't, like, make, like, copies of these things. So I'll just, like, remember, write down these codes so that I have, I check the book to make sure that it's the right one. And once it's used, that code will be invalid in the future. All right, coupon for 414 shop. This one will be, hmm, what do we want it to be? So the last one was 25% off your entire order. This one will be double netherite rewards points earned. <laughs> on your next, on your order. Because it doesn't have to be your next, it's just whenever you use this coupon. Okay, and then, good, did I have this all in caps? The good through? Yeah, okay. Good through, what did I do here? Did I just put the date or did I put like dot dot? Okay, just the date. I just wanna keep the format the same. Good through 4, 20, 22. And then let's get the numbers in here. Alright, that looks good. Easter coupon by 414 shop. Alright. Then next up, coupon for 414 shop. This one will be one free enchantment book. All right, and then at the bottom, good through four twenty twenty two, and then the little uh, code at the bottom again. 
Imagine, like, if I somehow typed one of the codes the same. Okay. Easter coupon by 414 shop. Okay. And then coupon. That's not coupon. Coupon for 414 shop. This is the final one here. So we have one free book. We have 25% off. And we have double netherite points. This one will be... Hmm, what else could we do? Like, I don't want them all to be, like, the same. But I also, like... Um, there's not, like, a whole lot you can really do with coupons. Because, really, you can just, like, get, like, certain items for free. Or get, like, a certain percent off. Or... Something like that. So, I think... Okay, what we'll do for this one is this one will just be this one will be um uh, it's so hard to come up with something i guess we'll just do 50 percent off 50 percent off your order your entire order so this is like the best one i think because i mean technically the book one would be good so but this one would be because i mean you could just get two books and then that would be like it, yeah like if people are smart they would just have a, a giant order which is the, the point of these things because if they have a giant order they'll spend more than they might have usually because they'll buy things that they might not have needed all right so good through for 2022 and then the little code i feel like a lot of them have been like starting with like eight <laughs> Or five. Whoa, those are really close. Five, six, three, four, and five, six, three, three. All right. Um, Easter coupon by four one four shop. Nice. All right. So these will be in eggs in no specific order. We'll put it in egg three. Egg. No idea what egg that even is. This one. And then the last one. All right, so now we need six other prizes. So I'm thinking we give like a mending book and two of them because mending books are like some of the most popular books. So what we're gonna do here is I need to go get some emeralds and go buy a mending book. But yeah, mending books are like one of the more popular books that people buy. So, I mean, this is basically the same as that one coupon that you get a free book, except for... Do I actually have any ending books yet? No, I gotta go buy some. Okay. So, we need... Oh, no, we need leather <laughs> for books. Because I used all my books for those uh, coupons and the, the Easter egg hunts. So, we need paper, emeralds. Let me just grab a whole bunch of paper. And we can actually go throw all these snowballs away here. Get all of those out of here. All right. And then we need, let me just grab, we'll just grab the, hopefully the wheat's grown up here. It is, okay. And then we just gotta breed these cows and then I'll be able to kill one cow. So hopefully we get at least two leather from it. Because I just went and like got a bunch of leather from my cows a little bit ago to get all those, um, the coupons and the, what are they called? The coupons and the Easter egg books. So, hopefully, the one cow, please, please give me a... How did a chicken get in here? Wait, what? Did someone, like, throw eggs in my pig pen or something? Alright, please. I need two leather from you. Three. Okay, perfect. You stay in there, cow. Alright, now let's go head back down here. Go make up some books here and then go trade. Hopefully we can get enough emeralds because I don't remember. Actually, I think my mending book, I have like a, it was a zombie villager that I transformed. So he has relatively lower prices. I also, you, you might not have seen this a villager trading hall that I made yet. I just made it kind of recently. So where is my mending villager did i see mending no mending i think he's down one more floor right here yep yeah is this the cheap one i believe 
Uh, yes he is. Okay, so let's trade some emeralds with you. We need to get 18 emeralds. Alright, perfect. We'll just keep going. Nice, okay. So, what is this one? Quick charge? We don't want quick charge too. Alright, mending, trade, trade. Alright, there we go. We got two mending books to put in the easter eggs. I really need to make like a better way in and out of here. But, I mean, eventually all the villagers, once I have them like fully bred and we have a book of everything, I'm not going to need to block it off because I'm not going to be letting them out ever to like make more villagers. But, anyways... Let's put a mending book in here and a mending book in here. So that is six of the rewards taken care of. I think we'll just give out like some diamonds in uh yeah, we'll give out some diamonds in some of the others. Just like a few diamonds or something. So we'll put two diamonds in here and then one diamond in here and three in this one okay and then how many do we have left there should be like two boxes left i think maybe yeah there's one okay we only have one box left so this box will be just some you know this box we'll put a netherite ingot in it whole netherite ingot Yeah, that was this one. Nope, that was this one. Wait, what? There it is. Okay. Alright, here is all the rewards. So if you get Easter Egg 1, you get a mending book. Easter Egg 2 is two diamonds. Easter Egg 3 is a coupon for double netherite points. Okay. Easter Egg 4 is a mending book. Easter Egg 5 is three diamonds. Easter Egg 6 is a coupon for a free enchantment book. Easter egg 7 is a netherite ingot. Easter egg 8 is a diamond. Easter egg 9 is a coupon for 50% off. And Easter egg 10 is 25% off. So I'd say that these are decent rewards. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go bring these over to my shop. And later today, when everyone gets on, we'll uh, start up the Easter egg hunt. So you guys have a little bit of time to uh, find these. But yeah, once you find them, just bring them over to my shop and I'll give you your reward. I'll just like wait in my store right now so that I can uh, give out the prizes. Does he have another book? He does. Alright, what, what, what one is this here? Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to open the book. <laughs> Alright. Book number nine. Let's... Hey, whoa. Ooh, you get an Easter coupon. Let's see what coupon this is. You get the 50% off your entire order coupon. Oh, he's got some books here, I guess. Some uh, Easter eggs. Let's see, what, what Easter eggs is he coming here with? Okay, he's got egg number eight. And egg number two. All right, let's see. Well, two diamonds for one of them. All right, and then egg number eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight is... Oh, just a bunch of diamonds. So that's all the diamond prizes. But, I mean, I personally think that the diamonds aren't really even the best ones. So, but you get three diamonds as well. There you go. Alright, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six eggs are still out there somewhere. Oh, Samuel's got some egg. Let's see, what egg is this? Ooh, egg number 10. I think this might be a good one. Actually, I can't remember. It's either a coupon or it's something really good. Okay, it's a coupon. So, 25% off, which isn't... I think that's like the worst coupon there is in these books, or in these eggs. But it's still something. Oh, does he have another egg? Oh, he does. Okay. He has egg number seven. All right, let's go take a look here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ooh, a netherite ingot. That's a pretty good one. Um, yeah, I could go, I could go back to spawn. Like the past 
anywhere on the island back to spawn um across the bridges there you go there's your netherite ingot oh here's another egg here's egg number six as well okay so one two three four five six you get another coupon i believe that might be the last coupon or there's one more you get one free enchantment book for this coupon Whoops, I didn't mean to shoot off a firework rocket, but... Does he have another egg? Does he have all the eggs? Alright, egg number one <laughs> is... Oh, a mending book. Okay, you get a free book of mending here. He has another egg. Does he have all of them? Is this all of the eggs? Or... No, there's... There's one more egg, unless he has that too, but... Alright, oh, this is the last coupon, and then the last one is, I know what the last one is, but I'm not going to say it. Double netherite points on your next order. Eh, right, well, no building in my shop. Alright, so there's one more egg out there. There's egg number four is still out there somewhere. The numbers at the bottom of the coupons, those are just to make sure that no one makes, like, a fraud coupon just so i know that it's a legitimate one. Oh, is this the last book egg number four is this an official book it is all right well he's found the last book here so and he gets a mending book all right there you go um that's it for the easter egg hunt you guys found all 10 of the eggs Maybe I'll uh, do another Easter egg hunt again next year. <laughs>